This video is to show the completed MRC 72 megahertz converted to 2.4 gigahertz using the FRSky XHT module. The one on the right is the original style with the old 72 megahertz and the one on the left is the upgraded 2.4 gigahertz module. As you can see at the top, the uh, XHT module has a has a card that has buttons and switches on it to configure it. The red or the white button is the uh, bind button, and I wanted a way to have the card available or the button available without having to cut holes in the original transmitter. I want to keep it as pristine as it was. Uh, the only thing I've added is a handle to the top to make it a little bit easier to carry, and this 3D printed box, which has a, uh, a piece of plastic that comes up from the bottom or a 3D printed module comes up from the bottom to help secure this plastic piece on top and that allows me to fish the wires for both the antenna wire and this module up through the original antenna hole which is about a 12 millimeter 13 millimeter hole. Um, if I take this transmitter and show you from the inside what we've done what I've done is the original circuit board is all the same. Nothing's changed in the original circuit board. The uh, uh, regular 7200 megahertz uh, transmitter card, which is this guy, I removed. I wasn't going to remove it at first, but then I decided to remove it. And as you can see, the wires from the XHT module or fished up through this 3D printed plug, if you will, that allows uh, the system to be mounted without having to cut any holes or anything into the into the, the current case. Um, one other thing that I did is to make the uh, meter work. Um, the meter normally worked off of the signal coming from the original 7200 megahertz card to show the power of the signal going out. What I've done is converted it to basically monitor the power of the battery. There was a power lead, or is a power lead, that comes off from this module that went to the uh, original 7200 megahertz card that had the power, and I just simply put a 10 uh, kilo-ohm uh, resistor in line to the power. The rest of the lines I didn't change. The only thing I did is replace this line by putting in the resistor and getting the power off the main board. So really it was pretty simple once I figured out where things were. The XHT gets its power off the main board. There's two uh, positive and negative coming off from that board. In the signal wire, I found uh, the spot coming off from the bottom. I took the board out and, and insulated it so that it wouldn't touch anything and uh, was able to convert this to 2.4 gigahertz very easily. Uh, I bought one of these free, free, one of these uh, cheapo uh, oscilloscopes and uh, was able to put that, use that to find the correct uh, PPM signal coming off from the card. And so once I found that, it was trivial to install this card and make it work. It's three wires, hot, cold, and signal, and that was it. So thanks guys. Hopefully uh, if anybody is doing one of these conversions, that helps. Um, and uh, love 3D printers. That thing turned out pretty good. All right, take care.